Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, install TeamViewer on your uh, Windows computer. This should work for uh, Windows anything above uh, Vista 7, 8, 10, whatever, and uh, 32 or 64 bit. So what you want to do is open up a browser and I'm also going to show you how to do this from all three popular browsers, Firefox, Chrome, and Internet Explorer. So we're going to start with Firefox first. Just uh, in the address bar, type in TeamViewer.com. It'll take you to their home site, uh, to their home site, home web page. Um, at this point, just click the download button, and a window will appear saying uh, there's a file to download and save it. So you click Save As or Save, and then it opens up another dialog box saying uh, this is where you want to locate it. Remember your location. I'm putting it in my downloads folder and that's the name of the file. <clears throat> Go ahead and click save and it'll download and at this point it should be done so I'm going to go ahead and click on the folder and then I'll click the team viewer uh, icon or file click run A dialog box appears asking you for some basic information. Do you want to proceed? Yes, basic install. Um, where do you, uh, what do you want to use TeamViewer for? You want to use it for personal, non commercial use if that's what you're using it for. If you're just uh, uh, an individual who is going to be helping out another individual or sharing desktops with just a, another individual then this is for you the other versions are gonna be paid versions this is the free version so um, that's it choose accept and finish click yes and the install procedure starts Uh, this window will appear when it's done, and this is uh, just explaining some of the features of the uh, applications. I suggest you go ahead and read it, and um, go ahead and click close when you're done. And that's it. The application is done and ready to go. How, t how to use it. Okay, um, we'll explain how to use it in, well, I'll explain it now. Okay, uh, at, if you're going to use uh, TeamViewer, both yourself and the person that you're going to be uh, connecting with has to uh, both have the program and uh, the remote user will have their ID and they need to tell you their ID and then you'll be copying you'll be entering their ID into this partner ID window here and then you click connect and then once you connect it'll ask you for a password now this password always changes so it uh, most likely won't be the same uh, every time you uh, you connect so again once you get prompted for the password you enter in the password that they'll have to tell you and you click connect and you're you're on your way you're able to connect to the remote desktop and do what you've got to do that's it um, if you're sharing if you want somebody to connect to you again you have to give them your ID and your password and that's it and they have to connect okay uh, that's all you have to do for uh, using TeamViewer now I'm going to show you how to install it from uh, the other applications let's go ahead and minimize this go ahead and close uh, Firefox let's try Chrome open that up again in the address bar just type in team viewer take you to the home page click on the download and a dialog box will appear just say download this is putting in a one because I already have it so otherwise it would just be the normal team viewer dot exe um, file name once that's done it's done downloading. You just click on the uh, button down there. You ch choose run. Same thing. Um, you click personal, blah, blah, blah. Since we've already gone through this installation, it's the same installation. You don't have to do it again. 
and we won't so we'll go ahead and close that window there and that's it that's it for for uh, Chrome let's go ahead and close that let's go to uh, Internet Explorer same thing type in the address bar up here teamviewer.com click the download button at the bottom of the screen you'll see uh, you'll see uh, some choices here you can save the file if you want to save it to uh, your download location or you can choose run um, let's go ahead and click save and it automatically saves it to your default location which in my case is here and as you can see it, it created a third one so that's uh, that's how that works now I'm gonna do it again and show you if you choose to run if you choose run it downloads it it's waiting it's doing a scan on it and uh, the window should pop up any second here there it is now you just go ahead and choose your options here again personal non-commercial if you're just using it for yourself for personal use I'm not going to continue and normally you would say accept and finish but uh, at this point I'm just going to click the red X that is it that is how you install all of the uh, different browsers for uh, TeamViewer or from the different browsers hope this video helped have a good day